Hello everyone, my name is Legend Rani and this game is Rise of Civilization. Now what this video is gonna be about, we had the small war in Kingdom Sims team. I personally don't wanna give more details what happened, why we all have our, our own version. Right, so... <clears throat> we just took a pass, a level 1 pass. And uh, the small alliance, 135 million power, it was part of a bigger family of alliances. Like the biggest one, it has like one and a half billion or something like that. Uh, so <clears throat> we didn't agree to you know to things. We didn't agree to terms. I had my own version of the story. They had their ver version of the story, and we had a little war. <laughs> so obviously, I, I recorded it. We we were fighting for uh, that particular pass. That, uh, that you guys see over there, which was uh, next to my area, next to my land. <clears throat> and uh, they used rally, we used rally. Uh, th there's been players who got zeroed. I'm gonna explain about the strategy that uh, I used. So basically it's just gonna be war and battles, war and battles. I'm just gonna get onto the file, uh, onto the video, and I'm just gonna speed it up a little bit. So, but before I speed it up, let me just uh, explain. So this was a level 1 pass, you know, you can only put 1 million in it. I took my infantry out, so this is why I changed the captain, I was just, I, I apologize. I put only infantry, so there was only infantry in the pass. So I used my charge martel and... Um, Richard the first as the main garrison commanders, which you guys know my Charles Martel is full infantry. So I had my full infantry build with uh, one million of infantry in the pass. <clears throat> so that that was my strategy. I can see that I didn't had any reasons to go to war. I waited for them to do the move. They said that the fact that I took the pass, uh, I did the first move. Well, maybe I oh yeah they are right. You know we agree to disagree. At the moment I drop the pass so in present day they own the pass until uh, the player who actually done this agreement which i was not involved in is gonna come online so when he's gonna come online we're actually gonna decide what's going to happen so we, we yeah i will say more after the video i can't say it at the beginning <laughs> right so let me just fast forward it when, uh, when it's getting interesting. My city was also very, very uh, close to the pass. Because, you can say, I wrote there more infantry ready for reinforcements for the pass. Because my city can hold 1 million uh, reinforcements. One, if I get rallied, I have 1 million reinforcements. Two, that reinforcement can go to the pass so that was the main reason why i told them uh, some of them they, they just uh, kept infantry outside outside the pass so <clears throat> we had tier 3 guys we had tier 3 into the pass there were players who didn't have tier 4 we had tier 4 tier 3 into the pass so obviously they rallied I'm gonna get to the point where, where where they rallied. I'm just gonna gonna get there. I think it's a little bit forward. So they will keep gathering, they will keep gathering, getting reinforcements. They didn't want to attack me apparently for some reason. My troops were there, I'm just farming. Nothing special. Uh, I had to send thousands of, of uh, emails. Uh, not thousands of emails, but I had to send loads of emails. Uh, put lots of markers. Keep refreshing the markers because when you know, if you don't know, when you refresh a marker, they also get a message into the chat. So there is an all message into the chat in chat when when you refresh a marker. So it was very very important to people to follow my strategy I even at some point I had to kick someone from the Alliance because he was sending 
mixture of troops to the pass which can ruin the full infantry I was inviting him after that I was explaining him why but you know it's where people need to follow what you're trying to do so they are gathering and gathering all right so this is when I when I put myself as uh, the rally leader because they are actually getting closer and closer they are preparing for March all right so there you go that is the rally now what what you've noticed why well, I didn't do it oh I done it oh my my Miramoto did not return home yet yes yeah, so this, this is why, why I haven't done it so what I have done when my Minamoto is gonna get home I rallied the rally full cavalry rally maxed out Minamoto maxed out double C all it had to do the pass it had to survive enough until the cavalry rally is gonna hit in <laughs> so you guys can already imagine uh, how it all, all went I was trying to try to tell everyone to clear the chat because you know it, it gets filled up uh, very very easy so yeah, it's, it's not easy to also lead and battle and uh, I couldn't live stream I could have done in to do this on a live stream that would be next thing possible so I had to make sure that uh, the rally is gonna be only Kavari because that was you know the whole point <laughs> and um, in the same time I had to make sure that uh, the pass has only infantry in it so there you go this is the moment when the rally is hitting the pass so it's not so devastating for the pass that's like 2000 damage and I'm doing like what 8000 damage there is a lot of skill damage though well, 1 million rally be behind Miramoto there is something but they already had to do the first reinforcement you guys notice that they already done the first reinforcement and I'm pretty sure the second reinforcement is gonna follow up I even zoomed in <laughs> so I can record it even better the rally is getting thin and we haven't gotten any reinforcement yet we didn't need to so there you go they reinforce again then reinforce again I mean, I suppose he reinforced. No, he had, he, had, he solo attacked the pass. Oh my God, that's a brave soul. That's a brave warrior, my my friend. Pelagius, you're the man. <clears throat> so this is how the battle started. You know, it just simply started. So the rally was reinforced again, I suppose, by Go Black. Now, Tomer is reinforcing the rally. I suppose so yep and this is was the slick move they that they have done they uh, ported they have a another pass just on top of this one uh, the big alliance Australia so they teleported on the right I'm gonna get there uh, in some moments they teleported on on the right with a couple of their members and attack us from behind so that was really intelligent I have to say that was really intelligent for them to do that so right now I moved and check and I bet that they they, um, they were putting hopes on that because I had my main commanders in the past my main commanders were defending in the past and um, my cavalry commander they are set up on rally so myself I was pinned down but the other members they they just recall their troops they managed to zero two or three people they weren't there for the loot definitely they were they were just there to to kill <clears throat> and um, 
the war we're just on i couldn't just keep myself in one place because you know i, I was co coordinating the battle so i had to to check everything make sure i'm everywhere while recording that's why i, I, I said that this is something that i could have not done during the live stream they probably plundered as well in the same time if there were any resources so that's drag or tn aoe <laughs> on, on those people that was really phenomenal to be honest it was just sitting there and just aoe group everyone <laughs> and guys what is a richard defending the pass i mean <laughs> seriously you don't swarm the pass because richard just reduce your damage i mean it's like one you, they reduce the damage and two he's just gonna generate more rage that means more healing and more shields from char from uh, charles <clears throat> so i was keep refreshing the messages that was uh, you know an, an important thing to do there you go ysg look at that aoe damage aoe damage oh my god there's so much aoe damage going on there's so many people they want to hit the pass yeah so little mary <clears throat> got beaten as well Charles Martel, Richard the first doing wonders again so how to defend the pass now you've seen it from a, from a boy legend running <laughs> and as I mentioned I don't have garrison talents I have full infantry talents because there's full infantry march in uh, in the in the pass there's full infantry there's only infantry in the pass and the people that were reinforcing, they were also reinforcing with only infantry. And this is the part where, where the rally got disbanded. Alright, so I was paying attention too much at the battle that I even skipped it. When, when the rally marched in. I was paying attention to so many things. It was, it wasn't easy. So let me just. Uh, I think it's now. No, another forty seconds. Come on, Minamoto, get in there, man. Get some action. Where is it? I think it should start now. This time. This time? No. No. A little bit more. Yeah, boy. Look at that. Look at my cavalry. Full cavalry rally. Full cavalry rally. There's only 1.1 million because no people are fighting in this in the same time. I mean, not at the moment, but we had to recall troops from uh, from the past. So this is our rally hitting their rally and you're noticing that the damage is increasing significantly on them and I think when the skills start to start to pop in oh my god that's 35,000 15,000 that was some devastating so yeah this is the part where some people had to retreat their troops so that so they go uh, defend the pass Look at that, 26,000, 27,000. And I don't know what happened in this moment because the rally got disbanded and no one disbanded it. No one disbanded the cavalry rally. Because it, I was the rally leader, so I believe that I was the only one that could have disbanded. So yeah, the rally got disbanded. I don't know, you know, as weird as it is to everyone. So I healed up, let me just uh, move forward a little bit. I moved in my archers into the pass. I moved my cavalry to, to start fight, fighting these guys. 
I move my archers into the past so I, so I can get my uh, my infantry out, but I just waited for, for the rally to get done. It was a long battle, I have all the reports, I, I saved them up, they, they lost big time. We had the losses as well, I'm, I'm not saying we. it was so nice for us, we had losses as well. Three people got zero. And um, Spaceman, Spaceman is, is getting it as well. So I got my Kavari out, but I was getting surrounded, so it wasn't really easy for me to. The whole point with my Kavari was just to play with them, you know, just to just to buy time because I was sure they they were just gonna chase me away, attack me. So basically, I was just buying time, you know, easy, <laughs> and it actually worked. Uh, at this point, the rally is done. <laughs> So yeah, the rally on the on the on the pass is done. We diminished the rally back then. There was battle going on. There's Dragotian spaceman came out came out for a, for a and people are just se sending troops troops aimlessly at the pass. I needed my infantry, though. I needed to get my infantry, and I also needed to move closer. So I think I made. This is was a, uh, you know, risky, a uh, very risky move. But there was nothing I could have done. I was thinking to send Scipio, but then I was thinking against the rally it might be better Herman and uh, El Cid because they, they might also <clears throat> silence and interrupt the rally. That was my, my thought. That's why I put. Uh, so look at that, they were just sending troops to die. Can you imagine that? <laughs> that was <laughs> that was so funny to watch. So they sent another rally on the pass. I should have kept my 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 Charles and Richard there, but it it was slightly impossible. All right, so I put my archer, I put commander, so I can uh, retreat my my infantry. So I can go go back there and, and uh, counter the other guys. And now that I put Herman and Elsid, there was happening some really big numbers from the past. So yeah, Stan got it as well. Poor fella. So look at that, 10,000 damage, 8,000 damage, 12,000 damage, oh my god, there's some big, big numbers. I was going to rally them, but I don't know, I think we were a little bit spread at this point. So I had to get in there, I had to get in the action. I had to teleport on, on the other side. Twenty thousand damage, fifteen thousand oh my god. That's some serious critical hits. So the fourth guy teleported in. 
I couldn't teleport there because I was rallying. So I cancelled the rally because there wasn't really many people joining in. And if that was the plan that how they wanted to play, I said we lose the pass, we lose the pass, but at least we had to first get, get rid of these guys. We can get the pass after Fate Changer. How about that? If they wanted to play with, with the zero coin, you know, we play with the zero coin. <coughs> So there you go. Zeroing players. And the whole point of zeroing, you need to make sure you keep hitting him. So you make sure you're. Uh... <clears throat> You're getting zeroed. I didn't like the way the way they they've done uh, attacking from behind, but you know I suppose they didn't like the way we took the pass either. So as I mentioned, we agreed, we disagreed with uh, with a lot of things. There you go, bam, and again. Out. What are you doing? I was just making sure to keep to keep my Charles on there, you know. <laughs> Obviously, I was not from there from the for the plan, you know. <laughs> I, I was there for something else. If they wanted to play the same way, you know, I mean, what can you do? And my next move was to my next move was to go in there in the middle. That's why I sent my cavalry to get rid of those barbarians. We had troops in the past, but I didn't have infantry. It would have been better to put someone else's leader, but I was a little bit busy at this point. So when I click teleport, look at that. He just got out uh, some archers or some troops. So I was like, you know what? If his troops are out, why not hit him? Mr. Pink is sending reinforcements. That was not really, really smart because that was uh, Sun Tzu defending. So he was obviously AOE hitting me. Which was not really looking good. Dara is reinforcing. So now I can actually teleport. Mr. Pinky Next one We were testing Mr. Pinky Let's see what Mr. Pinky can do At some point Aikung GS I think he lost too many troops And he's probably retreating Oof There's so much damage going on the city I could have probably take it down Could have probably take down Mr. Pinky, to be honest. Are those infantry or 
No, those are archers. Oh, so he's hitting me with archers. Look at that. If I would have let it on, I would, I would have get to zero. Oh, they attack my city. Look at that. Dara, you were so, so trying something. I believe so. Didn't really work out that well for you. And yeah, healing troops, it's, it's uh, something that... And now I'm gonna have to put to the next one. <laughs> it's not gonna be really, really <laughs> short, you know, there was a lot, a lot of war. So I have three more video files, I'm not sure how long are the other ones. Oh. Another 16 minutes, this one is 14 minutes, 37 minutes, oh wow, and one hour. I think I'm gonna play this one and just gonna let this be like... Um, the first part, maybe I'm, I'm making it uh, these two parts, so I'm not gonna make like a really really long video. There was group battles over there, so I don't know which one I targeted, but I got my uh, my John of Arc out and the Cleopatra for, for the buffs. I got them out as well. You know, doesn't hurt. Extra buffs to my troops. It looks like they were trying really, really hard to take down my troops. <laughs> so yeah, Mr. Pinky, if he's not zeroing innocent player is not really working that well for him Eesh. but you know when when they are uh, hitting innocents it works it works it works all the time and now dara is getting cornered there were so many numbers guys i don't even know what's happening there there's so many battles i don't even know who my cavalry is hitting who my um, Marshall is hitting yeah it, it, it's all crazy it's all going crazy numbers but yeah it did help it did help ta uh, taking out John of Arc and, uh, and Cleopatra it did help a lot so I was trying to get somewhere in between so I can my plan was to hit Dara <laughs> I'm serious that was my plan But yeah, I couldn't teleport. I should have just probably hit hit Mr. Pinky, because I believe I took down his watchtower. He was already uh, pretty much hurt at this point. And some ballistas, come on, heal up, heal up, guys, heal up couple of seconds forward there you go I'm healed up go on boys He has a lot of troops because he never lost troops. I think I even checked, uh, checked him, checked his email, uh, not his email, his information. So he never lost troops. So basically, he never had any problems. <clears throat> well, he's going on yellow. That's for sure. He's going on yellow. I'm being surrounded. Mr. Pinky came out.
And I think at some point I killed a lot too much infantry. I had to train some infantry at some point. I was just I was just trying at uh, this point to try to keep these guys busy. You know, to keep them as busy as possible. So there you go, four armies. Four armies surrounded, surrounded four times. Go, Kubaje, go. Show them what we can do. Mr. Pink is hitting catapults. He's feeling very strong hitting catapults. It, when when I have that many armies outside, it's so hard for me to actually control all the armies. My cavalry was getting pounded. My my siege was getting pounded. <laughs> What? Someone, uh, someone attacking Mr. Pinky. This is rule number one in war, guys. Rule number one in war. Keep healing. Keep your troops healed up. Keep your troops always healed up. That's the number. That's the number one ruling rule in war. You need to make sure that uh, you keep your troops healed up. <clears throat> six horsemen. What the f? What are six horsemen doing in my army? Are you freaking crazy? <laughs> oh, my throwing axemen are, are outside. Hmm? Yep. Ooh. Yes. Healing. Go, go. Alright, so my infantry is surrounded. They had big plans to take down my infantry. Big plans. So someone left away. Someone left, I mean. Lord Gollum. I didn't see him doing anything. I think he just came and left. <laughs> Oof, Mr. Pinky. Trying so hard to take down my infantry. Oh, Mr. Pinky. Oh my god, when my cavalry is, is hitting those archers, look at that. Who we? Don't worry, guys. Round two, fight. There is more to come. So where are you going? Fate changer. Yes. I forgot about it. That's a really good one. Fate changer. All right. So you want to fight? Come on, let's fight. I think I made made sure that I attacked his cavalry. And I sent my archers against his infantry. So my cavalry was, was on his cavalry. My archers were on his infantry. And I think they were trying so hard to, to take down my infantry, man. I don't know why. But they were trying. You know, at least I give them credits for trying. <sighs> Poor guys. Not... That all right, so I was trying to get my archers back, and I realized that I need to, to save some of, of the reports before they get lost with the past, especially with the past. 
This is when they rallied the past with Herman and El Cid, which you no know, gave us the loss. The reason we lost the past. But I prefer to give up the past and make sure that I'm taking care of these guys. It it wasn't worried me so much the ones that are on the other side, to be honest. As it much as it was worrying me this this uh, part. So this was the one which I saved it. <laughs> you saw how how long was the favorites? Yep, crazy. I have them all saved up. Had to do a little bit of healing. Training. So I don't. Ha so I make sure that every time I go back and in to have uh, 300,000, because you no, know, obviously I had the troops. Merchant. So let's see what what else happened. I think they set a they set a rally on me. This is how many troops Dara had. So 1.4. No, I one time he had like two million. He's close to 2 million, I think. Yeah, he sent a rally on me. Wow. <clears throat> they sent a rally on me, so I'm gonna start the other video, because uh, this one is not really that crazy. Let me just start the other video. Alright, so they cancelled the rally just in case it doesn't show up in this video they got me with that one i have to say they they got me with that one because i didn't took my troops out for like five minutes so they were able to do other stuff i was pretty sure they're gonna they're gonna rally me but they didn't so with that one they they actually got me yeah they, they canceled the rally they're gonna cancel the rally yep they canceled the rally so with that with that part they, they really got me. So I was just checking them to try to see what they have, but no, they, they used anti reconnaissance. I was thinking what to do. This that's that's what I I was not doing anything. I was thinking to rally them, I was thinking to I was actually thinking what to do. I also wanted to move somewhere closer in the same time. And in the end, I was like, you know, what else can we do? Let's just siege. <laughs> Are they gonna move or not? I should have just just let this one go because I'm pretty sure um, I would have been able to take it down completely. They would have just had a lot of of dead troops. Koopa J to the rescue Cuba J to the rescue have no fear Cuba J is here so the best and the most important thing is you set your Charles and Richard to do nothing I set my cavalry on uh, on his archers they were blindly blindly hitting hitting me my, my infantry man that was so funny and then I think I switched to his uh Yep, his cavalry. The other two guys seems to be pretty knocked out. Or not. The 
Looks like they still have some juice in them. So let's keep on going. Go, my cavalry! Go! Smash those archers! Smash them down! <laughs> so, my infantry. Alright, so he took out his infantry. He wants to fight to fight me with his infantry. So he's trying. He's trying really good to counter me. He's using uh, his cavalry against my archers, so he's doing really good on that particular part to, to try to counter me as much as possible. But it's not really working that well for him. Oof. Oh, look at that! His infantry is getting demolished. Oh my God! That's so devastating. Gudubert is trying as well something, but it's not really working for him. Hmm. General Wasabi, what have you done, my friend? My god, that was so devastating, General Wasabi. So now I put my cavalry on his cavalry, Mr. Pinky. And it doesn't look so white anymore. He's getting everything a little bit yellowish. Now it was the, the perfect time to hit him because I'm pretty sure he had large amount of injuries. Before he, he was about to heal but I didn't want to, I think I didn't want to hit cities at, at this point. Yeah, I bought the, <laughs> the 100 pack one. I'm not sure did I start the rally? No or later. They're not gonna rally me. They're just you know faking. I have plenty of reinforcements anyway. Yeah, I'm at one million dead troops. One point twenty <coughs> I lost about a hundred K hitting their cities. Let's see if I can go forward. So that's the the full army from uh, from Dara, two million and, and fifty six. So I send email again. <laughs> I had to chase these guys away because they were just, you know, sitting there doing doing next to nothing. They were they were getting too many on this on this part. Oh oh my god, that was so devastating. Poor fellas. Why did it even came? I don't know. Twelve thousand damage, eight thousand damage. Kaiser Z, what are you doing, Kaiser Z? Oh my god, people are getting demolished. Whew. I'm not sure, is this the moment they moved on the other side of the pass? Yeah, 
Yeah, this is the moment. So I hit the pass with, with just my army. I sent my cavalry as well, but I don't know why the, the cavalry went into the middle. So, wow, look at that damage, man. Look at the damage I'm doing it solo to the pass. <laughs> Unfortunately, my cavalry was not really a good option. But still, the, the pass is, is taking it. It's taking it good. Oof. So, those numbers. So I was like, what the hell, yo, I'm gonna take the pass solo, are you freaking crazy? I'm not sure, I think they tried to attack my city. I think so. I wasn't really paying attention. So I was really focusing on this part, hitting the rally. Yeah, yeah, he, he tried attacking me. <laughs> And this is the time when I when I realized that my alt account is over there all alone, not shielded, which they could have just zero. And now I think it's, it's the second time. Oh no, I changed my mind. So I had to log in on my account, pop a shield, log back in my main account. <laughs> Mr. Pinky was still there. So that's what they had in the past. That was a, a, a six-star Minamoto, a uh, six-star CPU. I'm sorry. And now I'm hitting the pass again with just my infantry. <laughs> that was <laughs> second wave. And the game crashed when I was trying to to chat Jesse. How? So there's 48 minutes on on, uh, on this video. Hmm. My infantry is just hitting the pass, yo. I'm just solo hitting the pass. Solo hitting the pass. <laughs> Look at that. My boys, my boys, my infantry, my throwing axemen. <laughs> They have something with heal inside. I'm not. I'm not. There is quite a, a significant amount of heal. <clears throat> All right. So I think I'm gonna leave this one for a. Uh, I'm. I'm gonna leave these two video for another time. So at this point, they had the pass. I'm just gonna do another video. I'm gonna leave this one as it is. And we can have some fun on the next video how about that 
all right guys i hope you're gonna enjoy this video i hope you're gonna enjoy our defense they would have never taken the pass if i would if i didn't re retreat to my charles master and uh, richard but if i wouldn't have done that we would have never managed to suppress this guy on the these guys on the top they were sneak uh, that were sneak attacking us so yeah the strategy worked really really good you saw what we've done we rallied we rallied the, the pass and uh, rallied the rally <laughs> it is a new thing apparently and it works so that was really really good all right don't forget there's gonna be a second part of this video which is gonna decide how this battle is going to end until next time this is your boy legend ronnie signing out take care yo and i hope you will enjoy this peace out